On this Earth Day, global warming and climate change are top of mind for many. The gradual warming of the Earth's atmosphere affects extreme weather like droughts and hurricanes. But did you know these types of natural disasters can play a role in disease spread and pandemics? In some cases, it can displace certain animal species and thereby bring them in closer contact um, with humans, either directly with humans or via domestic animals. And this then facilitates um, cross-species transmission so that viruses can be transmitted from these wild animal species onto humans and thereby um, cause outbreaks. As the earth warms, scientists are concerned about an increase in mosquito-borne viruses and infectious disease spread by animals. There's also the possibility that long dormant viruses frozen in ice could be released by thawing polar regions. According to some doctors in the past 20 years, several viral outbreaks have been linked to a combination of human and environmental factors, including SARS, MERS and Ebola. All right, let's send it over to Brad Panovich with more. Uh, Brad, you talked to someone even earlier in the newscast about global warming, and you do um, speaking engagements on this too. I know I'm always asking you questions about climate change. Yeah, you know, in Charlotte, we're warming just like most of the planet. We've warmed about 2.3 degrees since the first Earth Day back in uh, 1970. But our warming trend has actually been lower than other parts of the country. One of the a country, one of the biggest impacts we've seen locally, more so than the warming climate, has been heavier rainfall events. We did a story this morning about this. A warmer climate and atmosphere holds more moisture, so we tend to see higher rainfall events. So we're starting to see more flooding and two, three, four inch rainfall amounts that we normally wouldn't see 20, 30, 40 years ago. So this will impact an area like Charlotte more so than the temperatures because we're also rapidly developing. So runoff and flash flooding is going to become more of a concern as we go into the future. We've seen this in the last couple of years, and I expect we'll see this for the next several years.